Focus on your food. Focus on your food. Focus on your food. Food, 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 food. What's up, guys? Don't be the fat husband. It is the last week of January. The last week of January, people. Can you believe it? Can you believe it? We are on to the second month of 2015. Just like that. Boom. One twelfth of the way done. So you have one more week to make January something. Make it count for something. If you kind of blew it the rest of the month, just get right back on. Do it, just like we talked about a couple weeks ago. Um, I am actually waiting for Olivia. She is teaching a soul cycle class, and it's Sunday, and I usually take a rest day on Sunday, unless I've missed some days during the week working out. So I'm just sitting in the car in New York City. You can see the cars going by. I decided not to drive today because on our Don't Be the Fat Husband because I got a parking space, and I don't want to give it up. Such is life in the city. The other thing is, it's supposed to snow like 18 inches tomorrow. 18 inches. Can you believe that? 18 inches. That's a lot. I mean, I know for some of you, maybe in Canada or, you know, Minnesota or Maine or Chicago or some of these places, you know, you're like, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. But 18 inches is a lot. 18 inches is a lot. So it got me to thinking about what I want to talk about today. Which is, the food's the most important thing. It is. Exercising is so important, I feel like, for your body, for, you know, for refining things, for keeping your head in the right space, for burning more, for speeding up the weight loss process, and then once you're maintaining, for regulating, you know, just everything that's going on in your body. It's just good, good, good to sweat, all those things. But you may think I'm crazy, but I think it's pretty clear in all the stuff you read and everything that the food is everything. And listen, we know this deep down inside. What's the old thing? You can't out sweat a bad diet or you can't outrun a bad diet. I mean, you can work out like crazy, but if you're eating just like crap all the time, you're still either not going to lose any weight or you're going to gain weight. That's all there is to it. And so I got me thinking, okay, if we're snowed in for two or three days, it may be that we can't work out. So what are you going to do? Are you just going to fill yourself full of chips and and all this kind of stuff? No, you got to stay on it. You got to you got to focus on the food. And that's the crazy thing. Like when I first started losing weight, it was interesting because I worked out, but I didn't work out that intensely and I would work out like three, four times a week maybe, and there were a couple times where I had to, uh, because of work or whatever, I couldn't work out, but I was still losing like a pound a day. Now granted, before that I was eating just horribly, and then all of a sudden I was eating good, so there was a big difference there. But I found that, I mean, even when I don't work out, sometimes I'll get down pound-wise uh, a little bit further than I would if I did work out. Now that doesn't negate the benefits of working out, but you get what I'm saying? The food is everything. The food, food, food is everything. I think someone said it's absolutely, the food is vital, it's essential, the working out is good and, and highly, and have high priority. Does that make sense? So that's what I'm gonna encourage you with today. It's about your food. And if you're in a place where you can't afford the gym or it's so cold and you've got 18 inches of snow on the ground and it's going to be a while before you can get out, guess what? You can still lose weight. And guess what? You can not gain weight. And guess what? You can get healthy just by the food. Use the food as the fuel in your body. View it as medicine. I mean, like, really, the food can be like medicine. If you eat good stuff, it can really revitalize your entire body. And you can read story after story after story of people who really learn to eat well and to eat good things. And so that doesn't mean you don't enjoy yourself. That doesn't mean you don't have treats from time to time. It just means that the food is everything when it comes to your health. The working out is good and really important, but the food is priority. Get that on track, and all that other stuff will come in line, and you'll want to work out, and that will just help the process, and that will go faster, and all that kind of stuff. So that's my encouragement for today. Focus on your food. Focus on your food. Focus on your food. Food, 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 food. All right? So check out Ben Warren Music this week. Check out last week's Don't Be the Fat Husband, and have a great last week of January. I want to hear in the comments what your goal is for the last week of January. Okay? Let me know what it is, and we'll see you next time on Don't Be the Fat Husband. See you later, guys. Bye. Oh. Speed.
Nothing I 